Hi everyone and welcome to this month's video. This month I'll be working on the second costume for the Ava Gardner Museum in North Carolina and this is the striped dressing gown that was ultimately cut from the film and I'll talk about more about that in the second video where I'm actually making the dressing gown. Um, the videos this month will be structured the same as last month, there'll be two parts. In part one I'll be covering the making of the underwear which consists of a petticoat, corset and a camisole and then in the second video I'll be showing you the making of the actual dressing gown. So let's get into making these items and I'll see you all at the end with the finished underwear. I start by cutting out the upper part of the petticoat. I then machine these pieces together and sew on the lace trim to the bottom of the upper part. Next, I move on to cutting out the panels for the frill. I sew the frill sections together and gather the top edge to fit the bottom of the upper part. I then sew the frill and upper part together. Here you can see me sewing two pieces of the bordery anglaise trim together to make it double edged. I then cut out the final frill and apply the trim that I have just sewn together. Next I move on to cutting out the corset. Here I am sewing the centre front seam together, leaving spaces for the hooks to come through. Once I have the busk in place, I then top stitch it into position. I then start sewing the corset panels together. And sew in all the boning channels. I finish the top and bottom edges with bias binding, which I machine on one side and hand sew on the other. Finally, I move on to the camisole. This is made from a double layer of cotton and voile. I put in the gathering threads around the top edge of the voile layer. 
Next I sew all the pieces together down the side seams. Again I finish off the top and bottom edges with bias binding. Here you can see me gathering up the lace trim. I then sew on the lace trim under the insert lace. Here's the finished underwear. I've really enjoyed doing this. Um, it's the first time that I've made a corset in a very long time. And I think the petticoat is one of my favorite things that I've made recently. I love the frills and the lace detailing on it. This costume is now on display at the Ava Gardner Museum in Smithfield, North Carolina, and will be on display until the end of September next year, if you wish to go and visit and see them along with the green plaid dress that I made last month. And I will leave a link to the museum in the description below. Please join me in my next video where I will be making the striped dressing gown that was worn over this underwear and ultimately cut from the finished film. I'll see you all again very soon.